What's up guys, it's Kira here and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another haul video for you guys. I know, I know, I did just post one a few weeks ago, but when I posted that haul, I was actually still waiting on a delivery of lots of different clothing. And after that haul went live, they actually all arrived over the next few days. So this haul is very, very summer geared. And you're also going to see a lot of trends that are coming up in the summertime featured in this as well. As always, this will be a try on haul. I know you guys find it so much easier to figure out if you wanna buy something or not, if I'm actually wearing it myself. So I have done that again for you guys. And as always, the links to absolutely everything will be right down in the description below. So if you want more information on any of the pieces, on pricing or sizing or anything like that, I will leave every single link right down in the description. So don't worry, I got you. Okay, so without rambling on too much, let's get straight into the haul. And the first item that I'm gonna show you is from Pretty Little Thing, and it is probably the most summery piece in this whole haul. So it is this absolutely gorgeous tropical print wrap dress. This just screams summertime. It's got that gorgeous, bright, tropical print with palm leaves and flowers. It's in an amazing bright color. It's red, but it almost looks coral. It's so, so punchy and so, so summertime. And I also love the fit of this dress. It's got your flared sleeves, which are so popular for summertime. And it's also got that ruffling coming right down the front. And it's in a wrap cut, which is another style of dress that we're seeing a lot of in the summertime. I particularly love wrap dresses because they're so, so flattering. And all different figures you can cinch them in to fit you perfectly and they really are just one of those classic silhouettes that always looks so so good up next from pretty little thing i have another summer dress and it is this gorgeous bardo style ruffle dress it's actually a lot girlier than i would usually go for but i'm really am having a moment with all things pinstripe all things ruffled right now and this dress just hits so many different summer style notes for me so next up from pretty little thing i have another black top now i know this doesn't immediately scream summertime but star print is a massive trend for summer and we're seeing a lot of it on sheer pieces like this I think I'm gonna feature this in the sheer styling video that you guys requested which I am gonna put together for you um, all about wearing and layering sheer pieces for nights out and just in your day-to-day -day wardrobe in general so lastly from pretty little thing I got two denim skirts because I am just living for all things denim this summer uh, and every other summer and every season really I just love denim <laughs> so the first skirt that I got is this really Really, really nice light wash one it's kind of a mini cut it's very short and it's also very very cinched I'm a UK size 8 and I went for a size 8 in this and it's very snug like it just about closes I think it will stretch a little bit as I'm wearing it but if you are between sizes I would definitely go a size up because this is tight the second skirt that I picked up is this cute little a-line skirt this is in a nice little white denim material and it has silver button downs all the way down the front of it but I thought it would be a really fun one to add in my wardrobe especially because I have a lot of girly ruffled and kind of pastel color tops some of which you'll see now in this haul and I thought this would go really really well with them and the fit is good it's definitely not as tight as the previous skirt and yeah I just think it looks really really nice with all of my other summer bits. So that was everything from Pretty Little Thing and next I'm going to move on to an online shop called Missy Empire. They're a UK based shop that I actually had never shopped on before but I picked up four things recently and I'm really really happy with them so I'm going to show you what I got. So first up I got this gorgeous pinstriped wrap top. It has those gorgeous bell sleeves that we're seeing everywhere this summer. Firstly it's in a wrap style so you can make it fit your body perfectly and it has that kind of messy undone look so it doesn't need to be perfectly ironed. It's a little Little bit laid back but it also looks very very chic and put together as well I actually have this top in another print that I'm going to show you later on in the haul but I loved this blue pinstriped one it just hits so many styling notes for me for summer I feel like we're seeing so much of this print already and it is only set to continue and I definitely think this will be worn a lot over the next few months so next up from Missy Empire I got this really funny logo t-shirt and it says like realizing stuff which of course is the infamous Kylie quote that everybody made fun of that she then turned into a t-shirt for her kind of merchandise store. Well, Missy Empire actually did a kind of dupe of it for a much less expensive price. And I'm kind of loving the trend of logo t-shirts that is so popular this summer. So I thought I would try it out and I couldn't really think of a better logo than this. Missy Empire actually have a really good selection of logo t-shirts at the moment. They had some other really cool ones that I thought were great. I'll link some of them below, but this one had to be my favorite. Next up for Missy Empire, I have have this beautiful blush nude 
velvet material camisole dress and this is just so so stunning such a beautiful cut this would be so perfect for wearing on its own for like a night out if you wanted to go for definitely a more kind of sexy look or you could pair it over a t-shirt which is again a huge trend for spring summer it reminds me so so much of the RUMI slip dress which is I think about four or five hundred dollars and Missy Empire really nailed it it's so similar it's got that really simplistic back it also has an adjustable strap at the back so you can tie it in whatever way you want and it's just it's so slinky I think it's fab so finally for Missy Empire I picked up a gorgeous pair of camel trousers I can't believe that I actually didn't have a proper pair of camel kind of chino trousers in my wardrobe up until now and I kept seeing beautiful photos on my Instagram feed of them being styled up with a really simple white t-shirt or gingham print or one of those beautiful office-y striped tops that I showed you and I thought I really really needed one in my wardrobe for summer. I particularly like these ones because they have a super high waist on them with this cool little ruffle detail and they also come with a really nice ribbon belt that you can use and if you wanted to you could swap out this belt for one of your own belts. I would definitely wear this with my statement Gucci belt as well and I just think it's a really really nice pair of trousers and it's that perfect tan color. It's not too light, not too dark and really a big trend for summer and something that I will be wearing loads. So next up in my summer trends haul I have some pieces from Shein and they are a shop that I really really love shopping on because they do trends in such an affordable way but the only thing is the delivery can take quite a while. It can take between two to three weeks for your items to arrive, sometimes less, sometimes more. So what I usually do is I buy a good few pieces in one go and then when they all come in I can show them to you guys. So I have quite a few pieces here. So first up from Shein I got this gorgeous simple white shirt. Now the white shirt is all Always going to be a classic style staple that never goes out of style but I feel like the trend update this season is the big fluted sleeves and this one has huge sleeves it's got that really simple cut a nice little collar a button-down detail but it really is those sleeves that add that style element to it now it probably needs a little bit of an iron but I don't really mind wearing shirts with that crinkle effect I feel like it sometimes adds a little bit of style notes even though it is just you being lazy and not ironing your shirt but whatever okay so keeping in with shirts another trend for summertime is the deconstructed shirt and this shirt from Shein looks insane on the hanger but you'll see it when it's on me. It is this beautiful one shoulder button down deconstructed shirt that just looks really really different and it's just really, really cool. It actually comes with its own tie that you tie around to cinch it in. And it just has this really cool, fresh, summery vibe. Deconstructed shirts are a trend that we've not seen that much of so far, but they are set to be huge for summertime. So whether you wanna take your own shirt and kind of mess it up or chop it up or change it, you can also buy them in this style anyway. So this one, when I opened the package, looked so confusing. And once I figured out how to put it on, I was delighted with it. Another massive trend for summertime is gingham print. And we're seeing it in so many different styles. I already have a couple of gingham pieces in my wardrobe that I love, but this one that I picked up from Shein is amazing. And it's again, that beautiful billowy sleeved top, but it's in the gingham print and it's got those huge, gorgeous sleeves. It's got that great wrap style. So again, you're getting that perfect fit and I just love this. It's got a really, really long wrap around style so you can wrap it around your body twice, tie it in a big bow, and it just looks really fresh and chic and a little bit undone. I just think it's so, so gorgeous. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with this and I can't wait to wear it. Another one of my favorite trends for summertime is embroidery, and this top from Shein is so amazing it actually took my breath away when I took it out of the package and it is this amazing intricately embellished bell sleeved embroidered top and just look at the detail it's so so gorgeous I can't with this top you guys I'm so so impressed with it it looks so much more expensive than it is and I actually wore this in my last video about beauty and skincare and summer prep and I got a lot of comments asking me where it was from absolutely love this now another embroidered item from Shein that I picked up is this amazing dress oh it looks so beautiful on camera this is a midi length embroidered dress and it's just so 
so stunning. Again, the detail is so intricate. It's just so beautiful. It's got those big kind of billowed sleeves. It's a really nice length as well. I feel like it would look beautiful with a pair of ankle boots. And even though it's completely sheer, I mean, you could wear this over a pair of jeans if you wanted. You could wear it over a smaller dress or a camisole. It's just a real statement. And again, embroidery on sheer pieces is such a big trend for summertime. And places like Shein allow you to play into the trend without spending too much money, which I always think is really important when you are trying out trends. And if this is sold out, I will find something similar on the website and link it below for you guys. But I think it's actually still available. So next up from Shein, I picked up this beautiful feminine floaty tea dress. Now, I feel like I'm going through this like really girly phase for summer that I'm actually really, really loving. And this trend of printed flirty ruffle tea dresses is going nowhere for the summertime. This one looks like it's in a wrap style, but it is actually stitched. So you won't be able to adjust the fit on this. So if you get your right fit, it will be perfect. But it does have that wrap detail at the front where it's kind of layers of fabric, which I think is just gorgeous. Another dress that I picked up from Shein is this beautiful striped dress. Now you might think that this is very similar to the Pretty Little Thing dress that I showed you in the other part of this haul, but this one is very different. This is me justifying into myself. It's not a Bardot style. It has full t-shirt sleeves. It still has all those gorgeous ruffle details, but it also comes with this really cool sash that you tie around your waist to cinch it in. Now I really, really like this style of dress. And if I was going somewhere where I didn't want my shoulders shoulders all exposed like in the bardo top from Pretty Little Thing this would be perfect it's that little bit warmer it's a little bit more understated you're not really showing as much skin but it's still hitting all of those amazing trend notes it's got the pinstripe print it's got the floaty kind of bell sleeves it's just gorgeous. Now the last thing that I picked up from Shein is these gorgeous embroidered denim jeans and they have roses and chili peppers on them which I just think is so cool. Embroidered denim is another huge trend for summertime. It's also a really really fun way to update your denim. So whether you want to buy patches and pop them on your denim or you want to buy a pair of jeans that are pre-embroidered, these are just fun and so summery and a great way to work a staple like denim into your wardrobe in kind of a trendier way. Oh my god this haul is a big one. Okay so that is everything from Shein that I picked up and I have one piece from Boohoo that I want to show you and it's these really cool dungarees. Now what I love about these is that they actually came embroidered with my initials on them which is so cute. The embroidered denim is actually a service that Boohoo are starting to offer and I feel like it's definitely keeping up with the trends of having embroidered denim, personalized denim and I think this would look so so cute with the uh, Missy Empire like realizing stuff tee that I showed you or with one of the really floaty flouncy top. I think dungarees are something that people are oftentimes really really afraid to try out in their wardrobe but I think they can look so so cute and definitely appropriate for summertime because let's face it in Ireland it's still cold enough to wear something like dungarees you're not going to be too hot so I can't wait to style these up myself. So that is everything from clothing and now I'm going to move on to footwear because I have a few new pairs of shoes that I want to show you. So first up I have a gorgeous pair of suede puma trainers and they are from JD Sports and they are so summery I just love them that baby blue color is gorgeous. The pair that I've been living in day in day out are my vans and I really needed to give them a rest so I feel like these are a perfect summer shoe update. I think they would look gorgeous with the dungarees, with denim, with jeans. They've got that really nice pastel color but I love this platform. I feel like it's really updated and really really trendy. I will leave a link to them below. I believe they're under 100 euro as well and yeah I just I love these. So I also have a few pairs of shoes that I picked up from Ego and they are kind of an online shoe fashion website. They do really, really trendy shoes. Their prices are always really, really great. So the first pair I picked up are these incredible fur mule slippers. Now, obviously they are so similar, almost exact dupes of the Gucci versions and they look pretty convincing. Now, these are in a size seven. They actually didn't have a size six, which is my true size but the size seven fits perfectly, so much so that I would probably recommend going up a size in these mules because I don't think you want your foot to be like right at the end. I think you want your heel to be kind of like in that nice little spot there. When it comes to super expensive shoes like the Gucci versions, I just can't justify the price because they are realistically going to get wrecked. The leather is going to get scuffed. So I would much rather get a pair for an affordable price and have them loved and well-worn than spend 
800 euros on them. <laughs> so next up from Ego, I bought another pair of mule slip-on styles and these are really cool. They have like a faux fur detail at the toes and on the heel, which is really, really subtle and not super noticeable when you have them on, but it actually makes them a lot comfier and I think look a lot cheeker as well. I feel like this mule slip-on heel style is so big for summertime and I was actually quite afraid to buy a pair of these because I'm worried they would be so uncomfortable, but these are actually fine. So the final pair of heels that I picked up from Ego are a little bit out there and they are these blue lace up pointed biker boots. Now, I know these aren't gonna to be to everybody's taste, but I think that they're so cool. They're obviously uh, dupes of the Rihanna for Fenty collection, those really cool like sport heeled boots that she did. Um, they're also quite similar to the Public Desire black lace up heels that I showed you in my last haul. They actually really remind me of JLo back in the day and they feel very like Britney or Paris Hilton circa like 2003. And I just think that they're really, really cool. I would love to know what you guys think. Do you think these are absolutely hideous or do you love them? Let me know in the comments below because I feel like these will divide opinion. A lot of people aren't gonna like these. So there you go guys, that was my very trend driven spring summer haul. I hope that you enjoyed it and as always I've left links to everything right down in the description below so if you want more info on sizes or pricing it's all right down there in the description. If you liked this video feel free to give it a thumbs up as that would help me out a lot and if you would like to see more haul and fashion videos I will leave a link to a playlist right here. If you have not subscribed to my channel already I will leave a button up here. It's free and super easy to do. I post two new videos every single week and I would love to have you back for more. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next one. Bye!